Alright everyone, so this is some pretty major news for fans keeping track of the recent Marvel Now 2016 announcements or fans of Iron Man in general. Now Time Magazine recently sat down exclusively with writer Brian Michael Bendis to announce that Riri Williams will take over from Tony Stark as the new Iron Man, which they'll probably implement a slight name change there given that she is actually a female, not you know Iron Man, that wouldn't really make sense. But anyways, the series will start shortly after the events of the current Civil War 2 which we are now in and as we saw recently Marvel had premiered a new Divided We Stand cover that seemingly depicted the character as the new War Machine because uh, Williams was wearing this giant power armor like it looked like Iron Man inspired but it wasn't really Iron Man-esque. Uh, but obviously it's going to be Iron Man because she's not going to be War Machine. And uh, Bendis talked about, you know, fan backlash or people would be upset about it or stuff like that. But like he was saying, well, you know, characters like Miles Morales work or the female Thor and stuff like that. And that this doesn't necessarily tell fans spoilers of what will happen in Civil War 2. Like he doesn't say like, oh, Tony Stark's going to die or anything like that. Because on the actual cover, we see Tony Stark in this weird hologram image. So possibly he's mentoring Riri as she takes over as Iron Man or, uh, you know, just some type of different scenario can happen but we don't really know how Civil War 2 is going to end uh, so far really just been kind of rumors and stuff like that but um, anyways how I feel about this I'm not sure what to feel about this honestly I don't read Marvel comics anymore really uh, apart from like the odd issue of Miles Morales Spider-Man or something along those lines maybe even Moon Knight is actually pretty good too but you know I just don't really have any expectations or uh, excitement for this new Marvel Now initiative that they're going back to you know the divided we stand thing that's going to happen uh, post Civil War 2 because honestly Marvel now happened four years ago for me and I just kind of feel like they're retreading things and just adding stuff that really isn't necessary plus the uh, cover they released with all those characters with the lineup I don't really care about any of the characters in that lineup so I'm not too interested in this whole shake up uh, in Marvel comics because well frankly they do it every year now you know they bring in a new status quo and they say it's gonna stick around but then a year later they kind of relaunch again like a soft relaunch of this whole new initiative and then it doesn't really stick around so I don't know. Uh, tell me what you guys think of this uh, change down below, and are you excited for the new Marvel Now initiative that's going to happen this fall? Are you looking forward to any of the characters on the Divided We Stand cover that was recently released, and are you looking forward to this new uh, character taking over the mantle of Iron Man for Tony Stark? But anyways, post all your thoughts down in the comment section below. Let's get a good discussion going about this topic. If you're new to the channel and you like this video, hit that subscribe button down there, click the like button because it helps us out a lot. If you want to consider supporting us further, we have a Patreon where you can go check out. My name is Nick and I will catch you guys next time.